Good morning, stock traders. This is the Stock Sumo with BlueHorseshoeStocks.com. Today is Tuesday, June 4th, 2013. And today we're looking at OSL Holdings, Inc. That's ticker symbol OSLH. And this was another hot one off of our extended watch list yesterday. Seems like everything that we put on our extended watch list lately has just been blowing up couple key things I want to point out on the chart here is we're coming off of a key support level put this one on our extended watch list because we knew, noticed it was coming off of recent lows look here it was coming off of this two cent mark and this is a key support level because last time it came off of this two cent mark it ran as high as 25 cents so look at back here in the end of March beginning of April had this big volume and a massive move from the two cent range all the way up to 25 cents and then it had the consolidation held support here off of three and a half cents bounced up as high as seven and a half cents which is a key resistance mark that was yesterday's high so this is a key resistance area right here the seven and a half cent mark and then after that you have resistance at the 50 day moving average which is 0943 Notice yesterday's volume bar. Great volume flowing into the stock. We got the RSI passing through the 50 MA overlay. It's always good to see when the indicators get above the 50 uh, 50 day moving average. The next cross I want to see on this RSI is once we pass through the 50 line. That's going to be another positive sign. Looking at the PPO, looks like these lines are hooking up and we're getting a cross there. Same thing on the slow stow. We're getting a crossover on the slow stow. Both of these are bullish indicators. So we like the setup here with these indicators, how they're curling up and crossing over. Also, the histogram looks like it's ready to flip over to the bullish side. That's the first time that the bar flipped over here. I'd like to see those the histogram continue to build up to the bullish side. That's going to be a good sign. So moving forward, I'd like to see OSLH break above this key resistance at seven and a half cents. And if it could hold above seven and a half as support, that'll be a good sign. And then the next resistance point I want to see it get above is this 0943. Notice yesterday we passed through the 20 DMA that's sitting at 0443. I want to see that hold as our new support level. Definitely like the activity that we've seen with OSLH. Be sure to stop by our blog at BlueHorseshoeStocks.com and get signed up. We've been having some great calls lately. One of the wonderful things about our newsletter that separates us from the rest is we come out with multiple picks on a day-to-day -day basis. It's always good to stay well diversified, and we like to give our readers a good selection, and that's why we put out the extended watch list. Thanks for tuning in, and good luck.